Welcome to PowerVault, the smart way to store energy in your home. PowerVault stores solar energy or cheap electricity so that you can use it when you need it. The PowerVault can be used during a power cut to power small electrical loads and electronic devices. PowerVault helps you cut your electricity bills, reduce your carbon footprint and gain energy security. PowerVault is universally compatible with all solar panel systems and inverters. A PowerVault can be installed in less than two hours. Step 1. Your PowerVault delivery. Your PowerVault delivery will be shipped in two parts to enable ease of installation by one person. Your PowerVault delivery will contain the PowerVault unit, the accessory box located inside the PowerVault unit, and the batteries. PowerVaults come in a variety of capacities and battery technologies, so please check your instruction manual to ensure that you have the correct batteries for your installation. Wheel your power vault on its casters to the site of its installation. Step 2. Electrical wiring. The power vault should be connected to the main fuse board through its own dedicated 16 amp RCBO and a lockable rotary isolator. The G200 unit should be hardwired into the rotary isolator via a 10 amp rated fused spur. Additionally, an auxiliary power socket should be installed next to the fuse spur and used to power up any internet accessories that will be required. Step 3. Preparation for loading batteries. Please ensure that the power vault is completely isolated from the main supply. In order to install the batteries inside the G200 units, the left-hand side panel and top cover need to be removed. Please remove the six screws associated with the respective panels. There are three separate screws for each individual body panel. The screws are situated at the back of the unit. Slide the top cover backwards and lift carefully. Disconnect the earth connection. Carefully lift the side panel and slide outwards. This will uncover the battery compartment. Please ensure that you retain all components during this process as they will be needed to ensure operation. Step 4. Loading the batteries. For lead acid power vaults, please start by attaching one of the battery leads onto the positive and negative terminals of each of the batteries. Now slide the insulating covers over the terminals. Carefully slide the lead acid batteries onto the indicated shelves. There should be two batteries on a shelf. The order of the batteries within a pair is not relevant. The battery leads will now need to be plugged into the system via the connectors present in the wall of each compartment there should be a clicking sound to indicate a successful contact. If you are installing a 3 kilowatt power vault, the top shelf and the top battery connectors should be left untouched. For lithium-ion power vaults, carefully load the lithium-ion batteries into the indicator compartments. The order of the batteries within a pair is not relevant. Connect the power and data cables to the battery packs. If you are installing a 2 kilowatt power vault, the top shelf and the top battery connectors should be left empty. Now you have successfully connected the battery packs. Step 5. Putting the enclosure back together. Please reattach the previously removed enclosure panels. Start with the side panel, then make sure you connect the earth wire to the top panel before you slide it back into place and screw everything back together. You can now turn the rotary isolator switch on. Step 6. Connecting the current clamp. Clamp the current sensor onto the main incomer with the arrow pointing in the direction of the current flowing into the house. Then plug the 3.5mm jack into the top round socket on the back of the power vault. Step 7. Connecting the power vault to the internet. For wired connections, please connect the G200 to the customer's internet router by the Ethernet cable. Register your power vault by following the link on screen. Remember, your power vault must be registered and remain online for the warranty to be valid. Your power vault is now ready to use.